everyone! Today I'm showing you how I do an English to Western makeup look using the Urban Decay Naked One palette. So I went ahead and did my brows off camera with the Anastasia Dip Brow. And now I'm just spraying my face with the H2O Plus Face Oasis Mist. Then I just go on with the Too Faced Hangover Primer and prime my face to add a little bit more moisture. And then I'm using the L'Oreal Infallible Never Fail Makeup uh, for my foundation. And I just blend this in using a Real Tec Techniques Sculpting Brush. I can never say Real Techniques. I don't know what it is. Then I'm just going in with my Rimmel True Match Concealer under my eyes and a little bit on the center of my nose and then on my chin and using the same brush to blend that out. Now I'm just setting all of those areas using the Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. And what I'm doing is a technique called baking. So you basically just put like excessive amounts of powder on those areas that you want to set. And it'll make your concealer last all day, which would be great for horse shows. And then I'm just going in with a cream bronzer. This is the... It's called like Makeup and Glow, but I'll link it down below. Oh yeah, it's by W7. I got mine on Amazon. But basically cream products are gonna last a lot longer. So that's what I'm doing and I'm taking it again, the same brush and putting this on the outer perimeter of my face. Now I'm using my Benefit Hello Flawless powder to set the rest of my face. And now I'm just taking the Kat Von D shade and light palette and to contour I'm using the first two shades and my Tarte, um, I think it's called Swivel Cheek Brush or something. <laughs> And then I just take that first and last shade and clean up my contour a little bit. This will just bring the brightness back to that area and really clean up that um, contour. And I'm using that same brush, which is an e.l.f. Um, blush brush, to sweep away all of that powder. Now I'm just taking both of the same colors, uh, contour shades out of the Kat Von D palette to contour my nose. And then for highlight, I'm using, as always, the Balm's Mary Luminizer and putting on the top of my cheekbones. Now for blush, I'm using Urban Decay's Video Blush. It's just a very neutral kind of color, so it'll go with any outfit you pair it with. I'm just on the apples of my cheeks and a little bit up towards my contour and highlight. Now to prime my eyes, I just went ahead and used the MAC Concealer um, Mineralized Natural Concealer. Again, I'll link it down below. And then setting that with the Wet n Wild um, Brulee Eyeshadow. Then for the first colors out of the Naked One palette, I am using Naked to fluff it all over my crease with the Morphe M504 and then I'm taking Buck and doing the same thing. This can be very smoky, it does not have to be neat, it can go wherever it wants. Then I sprayed my brush and I'm taking the color Sin and Toasted and using that all over my eyelid. Next I just take the color Hustle, that's the color on a Crown Infinity Double Ended Brush and I'm putting this on the outer corner and V of my eye. And then blending those two together with no additional product. Now I'm just taking Sin on another wet brush and packing this right over top the center of the lid to add a little bit more brightness and then intensifying that dark color once more. Now I go in with a mix of Naked and Buck and blend out the crease once more. This will add a little bit more warmth and depth and just blend it all together. Now I'm taking Virgin and using this as a brow bone highlight and then taking a little bit on my finger and popping it on the inner corner of my eye. Next I just take a little bit more Buck and Naked and smudge it along my lower lash line just with the pencil brush and then doing the same thing with the color Hustle, keeping this on the outer third of my lower lash line. I guess it's more like the outer half. <laughs> now I'm just going to line my eyes using the Tarte Tartist Eyeliner. And this is kind of how I do it. I just do the like outer wing part first and then bring it down towards my eye. And then I slowly build up the line um, to the inner part of my eye. And this is like a really drawn out long process, but this is just the gist of it. 
But anyways, then I go in and fill it in. Now I'm using the L'Oreal Eyeliner Gel Infallible Eyeliner in Tight Lining. And then I'm taking the Urban Decay Eyeliner in Yeo and using that on my waterline. Now I just went off camera and popped on some Ardell Demi Wispy or Wisp, Wispies, sorry. And then some MAC Extended Play Mascara. And then for my lips, I was kind of all over the place, but I started with the Kat Von D Liquid Lipstick in Lolita and just put it on like I normally would. Then I just went in with Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Lipstick in Pure Hollywood. Put that on the center of my lips and then went back in with the Kat Von D one to kind of center the um, lighter part. And then I just used my finger to dab it all out and blend it together. So that is it for this look. I used, once again, the Naked One palette, and I hope you enjoyed this look. It was requested, so if you have any other requests, please leave them down below. Of course, feel free to change it to what suits you. See you in my next video.